The stage is set, and the glittering prize awaits one of these two teams. But which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup Final? Stay with us, we'll have it all for you coming up next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup Final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's the United States against Brazil. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be. Here's how it looks for the United States. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Lucas Paqueta starts with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the striker is the very creative and eye-catching Richarlison. is underway Richarlison is with Vinicius Junior making a bit of headway great opportunity and there it is living history the opening goal of the 2022 World Cup Final Incredible celebrations. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Walker Zimmerman. It's way up on the ball. Dest. A fine use of the ball. Way up. McKenney. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. Goal! 
so in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser 1-1 Richarlison Richarlison can he put them in front oh he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal keeper has it now Robinson Pulisic and it's with McKenney. he's going forward well here might jump in front. Oh, a goal! As they forge ahead on this massive occasion, feel the passion. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Well underway again, it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Marquinhos. It's with Vinicius Junior. Excellent vision. Neymar, on to Casimiro, well that is how to nullify the opposition, Timothy Weah, it's with Vinicius Junior, Casimiro, and Brazil in a position of menace, and a chance to level it, And the United States recovering possession well. Weston McKenney. Tyler Adams. And Pulisic has it. Now can they counter clinically. Excellent ball over the top. Vinicius Jr. Danilo. Can he put it away? And still an opportunity. Able to get his body in the way. Richarlison. This could be the equaliser. And it is the equaliser. Well, now, that could be a huge turning point in this game. They carry the momentum. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. So, back underway. The game having been squared at 2-2. Serginio Dest Timothy Weah Dest Tyler Adams Musa well not the pass he had in mind Vinicius Junior on the ball Richarlison and the pass could do damage and doing all he can to grab his second of the game. Well, he's been a real live wire today. A constant threat to this back line. So the corner played into the box. And the corner too close to the goalkeeper that time. Yunus Musa. Ream with it.
Yunus Musa. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Well, showing good defensive judgment. Vinicius Junior. Well, they know they need to stop him. The first half here comes to an end. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Pulisic. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Eder Militao on the ball Richarlison and back with Neymar given away by Brazil Jesus Ferreira Yunus Musa and well, they've given him too much space strong play here way up can they forge ahead? Oh, it's in! They're in front here! Now can they stay in front? Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel, but you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. get the ball rolling once more will they react to this setback deciding to go inside Richarlison Richarlison oh goal it is the equaliser in this final what next in the drama well that's really good awareness of the situation he just places that beyond the keeper. That's a top-class finish. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Pulisic. A delicious piece of skill. Are well, they going to forge ahead? And there is the goal to make it a hat trick. Excellence in finishing. There for all to see. Well, here it is again. And credit to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. Goal! Well, what an extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? Vinicius Junior. Richarlison and Brazil unable to retain possession all over the top but it will go through to the keeper Casemiro this is Thiago Silva 
Now Casemiro. They do pass the ball with authority. Taking care of business defensively here. Good bit of pressing. Richarlison. Here's Casemiro. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Jesus Ferreira keeping possession of the ball with authority. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Vinicius. Well, what a good piece of goalkeeping that was. But the equaliser can't be long in coming, surely. And on the front foot again, no let-up from them at all. Options in the middle. And after the cross, a tremendous block. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why he's upset. He got something on it, but not enough to keep it out. That's frustrating for a keeper. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Trying to get onto the front foot with the minutes ticking away. But quick thinking defensively. Throw in for Brazil. Now possibilities in the centre. Richarlison. Back to Paqueta. And lining it up. A good and fair challenge. Could be a chance to break here. Adams. It's way up on the ball. Musa. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Paqueta, Neymar, on the attack as there to be late excitement, and Neymar, can he put them in front, oh a goal, and how important could that be, maybe it's a story of one hand on the trophy at this stage of the final, a huge moment. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. And the referee brings this final to an end for the first time in 20 years. Brazil are world champions once more. Well, no surprise there, Derek. Brazil have been brilliant and they fully deserve this trophy.
Brazil, the world champions. And this triumph, you just feel, Stuart, is going to be fondly remembered by all Brazilians. You're absolutely right. They've played some great football. They've been inspiring. There's been some great individual performances. It's been outstanding from them.